While the Hunger Games franchise did a good job of bringing Suzanne Collins' books to life, there are many smaller details the movies left out which, in hindsight, could have made the story better. The Hunger Games trilogy was first adapted to film in 2012. For movies later, the franchise is one of the most popular and well-known young adult stories of all time. The series takes place in a dystopian version of America called Paynum, where children are forced to fight to the death in a competition called The Hunger Games. The protagonist, Katniss Everdeen, becomes a tribute. Despite the fact that the film franchise was split into four Hunger Games movies to accommodate three books, there are still plenty of aspects of the original books that the on-screen adaptations left out. Katniss may have been notable due to her iconic braid in both the book and the movie, but in just two hours, it was impossible for the movies to include everything, especially when it came to Katniss' backstory. In this way, the movies missed out on details that could have shed more light on the Hunger Games story, its characters, and their actions. Katniss and Peeta's disabilities are missing from the Hunger Games movies. Katniss goes deaf and Peeta loses his leg in the Hunger Games. One notable part of the original The Hunger Games book is that Katniss and Peeta both leave the 74th Hunger Games with major injuries that the movie doesn't include. First, Katniss becomes deaf in one ear halfway through the games after she blows up the career supplies. This occurs while she is allied with Rue. Meanwhile, Peeta is stabbed in the thigh by Kato, and by the end of the games, his leg is injured yet again by a Hunger Games mutt. This leaves Peeta's leg destroyed, and he is given a prosthetic leg once he returns from the arena. Katniss does lose her hearing after the career's explosion, however this deafness does not last like it does in the book. If anything, it heals itself right away. In a similar fashion, Peeta's leg injuries are depicted in the movie, however they are very quickly fixed at the end of the Hunger Games with a healing gel. In this way, Peeta's prosthetic leg is completely erased, and Katniss' deafness is reduced to a single scene. How Katniss being deaf changed her Hunger Games story. Katniss' deafness made the Hunger Games harder. Katniss holds three fingers up to the cameras in the Hunger Games. Although Katniss' deafness doesn't last beyond the end of the Hunger Games, it is still an important moment for her journey. Katniss enters the games as a very serious threat, however, the competition continuously raises the stakes against her. When she gets stung by the tracker jackers, she is set further behind. When she allies herself with an injured PETA, she struggles even more. Therefore, when Katniss is made deaf by the career's explosion, her game is seriously affected. Without hearing in one ear, her natural skill as a hunter is lessened, making her and PETA vulnerable.